Hello everyone. I want to show you something that I got in the mail today. I ordered it several weeks ago. They are the uh, stamps from Paul McCartney from the UK. And uh, before I show you these, uh, these are items that I, I was not interested in getting. This was one of those times where I really didn't think I was going to jump in the pool, so to speak, and go in like everybody else and get it. But what happened was that uh, I watched uh, a video by Mark P. And Mark uh, showed his uh, stamps. And I'll show you specifically what made me interested due to Mark's video in getting it. Um, before I go on, I want to say, you know, it's weird because uh, it's funny. Mark P. influenced me two times, like in one week. I saw two of his videos. Mark was also the person who got me uh, motivated by watching his video to pick up the Yellow Submarine Crosley phonograph for Record Store Day. Uh, I saw I saw him demonstrate it and I liked it. Now, I originally, if you saw that video, I originally was going to mention Mark P in there, but I kind of mumbled his name and it was like Marv P. And it sounded like I was saying Marv with a V. Marv P. It's Mark P. So I had to edit it out. Sorry, Mark doing the K sound, Mark. Anyway, so it's Mark P in this case. And anyway, here it is. Uh, as I take a look at what's in here, I don't really know what's in here. This is called uh, the Paul McCartney Bundle, it's called. There's a lot of different variations of these stamps. And uh, I, I, I don't know. I didn't know which way to go. That's why I figured, well, I don't know which way to go with this. So therefore, I'm just not going to go anyway. And decided not to get it and I didn't really care that much to tell you the truth but as I show you this this will tell the tale of why thanks to Mark's video I decided to go ahead and order it this is the reason forget about the stamps I ordered it seriously because I like when Mark was showing this I don't know what you call it, this gatefold item that actually uh, houses the stamps it's actually the, <laughs> the folder that has the stamps inside it is the reason why I got interested in ordering this. Now, this is uh, like an uh, LP size, and I'm noticing already it's got the resealable bag here. I've seen a lot of people showing this, and I've seen a lot of people showing stamps that do not come in this casing, and uh, I'm, I'm not really interested in those, folks. No, you know, no offense to anybody who got a variation of this, but I got this one simply because... I really liked this. Now, as you can see, it's got a uh, Paul McCartney silver signature on there. Not, you know, not his, not his actual signature, of course. It's stamped on there. Uh, but what I like about it the most is the back cover is a different era of Paul, kind of making the same kind of uh, expression, eyes closed face, if you will. And when you open it up, Look at that. That is the reason that I decided after seeing Mark P's video to go ahead and order this for myself because of this. The stamps that are inside, eh, that's an extra bonus. But this is what I, what I wanted. In fact, I usually don't break up items. If I collect something, I, I won't break up an item just to say frame it. But I'm thinking seriously about framing this just like that. You know, one day. So anyway, when you do open it up, there's a gatefold in there, as I said, and there are stamps inside. They kind of sit in there in the pockets. If you can notice, they sit in there very handily. Um, I, I, I'm going to see what we got first. These also were in there. So let's start with what's inside. The sleeves, the jackets, just like an LP. And in here you have these really nice large size like an album size stamp cardboard variations of the album covers some of the album covers of paul and i think they're very nice uh, to tell you the truth uh, i don't get too excited over these when they're the um album covers these are nice because of the size of them i like i like this the size is very uh very much fun and very attractive this sleeve here has more 
But generally speaking, when it comes to the stamps themselves, I'm not really uh, that uh, impressed by album sleeves. We've seen the album sleeves many, many times. I'd rather see unique photos of Paul himself on the actual stamps. And I think uh, we got a little of that going on here in what's called the bundle. Remember, if you look this up, this is called the bundle. Um, now, if I'm to remove these here, we'll remove this one first. These seem to be actual stamps. A nice uh, photo of Paul at the piano there, and then on the back... Another shot of Paul. Very nice. And that kind of sits in there. I'll put this back together once I'm done with the video. And this one here. You see, this is more along the lines of what I think I like for the stamps. Uh, I can't tell if these are actual stamps or not. I take that back. I don't know if these are actual stamps or just... I think these are actual stamps. And so these are actual stamps, I think. But you got Paul in the studio. You see that? That's more interesting to me for stamps. I'd rather see a shot of McCartney like that rather than just the album covers. You know, so this is a nice, uh, nice uh, item here. There's Paul working with an orchestra in the studio. All right. I got to remember how this goes. And that's it for this. But also in this bundle, I remember that's the name of the item, the Paul McCartney bundle. Uh, there is a book here, Paul McCartney, Royal Mail Prestige Stamp Book, as you can probably read there, the Royal Mail Prestige Stamp Book. That's the back of it. And, wow, there's a lot of stuff to see here. I don't know how much of it I can show you. Nope. Get the direction proper. Proper direction. And I see there appear to be actual stamps in here. You know, album cover stamps, the early days, rock show, it says here, and more album covers. And the other me, named, these are all, you know, McCartney song titles, the other me. And these seem to be actual postage stamps. Well, in there. Yeah. So, okay, yeah. Uh, nice little item. Also, in the bundle, we have this uh, Royal Mail stamps, yeah. Actual stamps. On the back. Um, just slide it out of here very gently. Hmm. Glossy. Back of this piece. Paul McCartney in the studio. These, uh, again, seem to be actual stamps. I say the album cover stamps. I mean, the whole package together as a whole is a nice presentation. But uh, on their own, I don't think I would have been thrilled with the stamps. But uh, the way they come... With all this information and... quotes from Paul. Yeah, it's a nice package, the whole thing. I'm glad I decided to wait a while, a little while, I didn't jump right on this, and actually get the bundle. 
uh, so to speak. So, yeah, thank you to Mark P for uh, showing me his uh, pickup, which is the reason why I got it. And as I say, uh, if it wasn't for the fact that I thought this was so cool, there's no way I would have even wound up ordering it on my own. So, thanks again for watching, everybody. And maybe I've influenced some people to get the stamps, too. I'm glad I did. Thank you.